Today, I am walking down to Waystone to do something that I haven't done uh, since we opened the place, which is play a casual game of 40k. Not in a tournament, and I'm not filming it, I'm just gonna go have fun. It is a lovely, blustery fall Seattle day, and I'm gonna really enjoy the walk down. I have the great fortune of living maybe a 20 minute, half hour walk from my place of business. Uh, so I'm having a nice walk there today. I'm gonna pick myself up a latte on the way. And yeah, I'm playing Aaron's Death Guard. This'll be fun. So in my continued effort to move away from Battlescribe in case that software just dies, um, I'm still trying to use Game Workshop's list building app and I want to include Valencia in today's game, but in order to have her rules on the app, I need Warzone, Octarius, Book One, Rising Tide. Otherwise, just a little lock symbol. And you can't buy that book anymore. So, I'm just gonna go off of memory, I guess, for Valencia's rules. Fortunately, I, I've used the same thing forever for her, but it's weird that I just, there's physically no way for me to, like, legally get the rules for my Inquisitor. Sucks. Coffee acquired, ready to slay demons and heretics. Hey Graham, I'm filming you. How is it being behind the bar? Right now you're filming it. <laughs> so is, is Graham shadowing you or are you shadowing Graham? Excellent. Yeah, Graham, Graham and Janice are going to be taking over on Tuesdays for us, which will be fun. Go team. Graham, can I have a beer? Graham. Can you pour me a beer? May I? May, may I have a beer? I want, I want the uh... Like the sick twisted oh, It's excellent. Full of terror. I did want that one, exactly. Way to, way to anticipate my needs. I appreciate it. Thank you. Do I have to pay you since I own the place? Absolutely, you do. Nice. Um, that's the, that's the complicated part of the list. Everything else is WYSIWYG. Flavorings? Garrett! Garrett, you're playing Dark Angels. Yes. How are they doing? Um, really surprisingly well. Yeah? Yeah, the dice have been favoring me too. Oh, that's good. Mark, I feel like you've had a rough couple of games recently. Yeah, I mean, this is a, the closest game in a while, but uh, I think I'm going to lose by about 20 points or so. But this is a good one. It's that's excellent. Kind of good times. We're gonna see Typhus right here. The game was really fun. I didn't film a lot of it because it just had a good time throwing dice. Uh, we ended up tying at yeah, 80 points to 80 points in the Tempest of War match. There was some really cool shit. Uh, Samandus killed a Decimator in one fight phase, which is just rad. It was the first like, casual game of 40k I've played in many months. So I have some thoughts on the state of Grey Knights right now. Um, admittedly, I'm not really sure how they're doing competitively, like in the meta, but um, man, that game I played yesterday went really, really well. But our strategies are too expensive. I used two silver armor once, and I regretted it because it only paid off for one die roll. And two CP for transhuman is far too expensive. I'd love to see a rework of our stratagems. It would be really neat. I'd like to see a rework of the whole codex, honestly. Don't get me wrong, grants are still fun. I still love them, but especially with some some of the more recent codices, it's evident that ours was. Uh, not exceptionally well thought out, especially since, uh, <laughs> especially since the advent of the Demons Codex. Um, in particular, the fact that uh, the Demon Hunter 
warlord trait. Let me ignore demon invulns. And demons don't have invulns now. So it does literally nothing, which is cool. Also, a little, like, a piece of errata or something that said that Grey Knights could ignore the fearsome aura that demons give out, the minus one leadership thing that they give out. Uh, if Grey Knights could ignore that, it wouldn't, like, be game-changing, but it'd be neat, it'd be thematic, it'd be fluffy, and it'd feel cool. Uh, it sucks that my Terminators have leadership seven around them. As a preview for next week, I'm working on a video right now where I, I'm gonna switch up my, uh, my Grey Knight's painting style a little bit. Not by a lot, I'm still gonna do the tried and true method that I've been doing for a while, but I've learned a lot with painting my word bearers and I'm taking some of the skills that I learned over this summer with my word bearers to apply it to my true faction, the Grey Knights. I've also done some Zenithal highlighting with my uh, priming and we're gonna see if that makes a big difference. Anyway, this is just a preview. Next week I'll have a video all about this and tell you guys how that turns out. Also, I'd like to get you guys involved in some more stuff. I think one of the bigger um, appeals of this sort of thing, uh, the YouTube like Warhammer hobby videos, um, I think an appeal about this kind of thing is that I can interact with a lot of people and people can interact with me and it becomes a much more social thing than, it be, than it's just like a, um, just a how-to video or something like that. Um, so I wanna do something that involves you guys more and I think that would really motivate me to start making some more interesting content. Um, whether that be like questionnaires, uh, list reviews, um, taking suggestions for how-to videos or Hell, maybe like list suggestions for uh, battle reports, uh, something like that. I'm stirring a lot of those ideas around in the pot of my mind at the moment, and we're gonna see uh, what comes out of there. But yeah, if you have any suggestions for content like that, um, things you'd like to see that are very community driven, I'd love to get involved with that. I'd like to start doing that. So yeah, um, let me know what you think. Uh, thanks for watching this short, dumb, nearly pointless video. <laughs>